All right, what is up, guys? I decided to make another video right after the one that I just recorded. So this time we will be... I'm kind of recording hungry right now. I apologize. This time we will be reviewing another excellent TV show that I had a fun time watching but was unfortunately canceled, actually. And they had to finish it early. So there's only two seasons this show, and I own them by, wrote both right here. Without a further ado... One of my favorite shows of all time, Revolution. I paid about $22. I got a bargain on this on Amazon around Black Friday. I paid about $22 for this. This is actually a really great show. It's basically like every millennial's worst nightmare. All the power goes out in the world by some kind of nanovirus in the air. And uh, there's these pendant things. Well, see, what happens is the world power goes out. Everybody's flipping shit. And uh, basically, we can't use any electronics or any guns, no electricity. No, we have to use fire. So it goes back to, like, Civil War air, and they're using trains and stuff. So then people start ganging up, and then we have, like, a uh, Civil War. And uh, this is just a summary of season one. Then we start having a civil war, and, uh, oh, shit, what was that dude's name? I can't remember this guy. He's, like, he's a leader of the bad guys, and then you got Malcolm. I do remember his name because he was fucking awesome. Um, he betrayed him, and now he's, like, dude, this whole story, they're all related or something, like, they're dad, uncle. Deformed brother. Anyway, long story short. Uh, uh, long story short, there's these uh, pendants that the government made. And uh, the main character's dad. Dith. Dish is the main character. The daughter of a dad that's dead. This douche nozzle is the leader of the leader of the bad guys. This is the guy that betrayed his brother. He's this guy's brother right there. And then this guy chases this chick around because she has fallen in love with his kid. And then that's her mother. And this is the kid she falls in love with. And this is the kid that looks at... I mean, this is the chick that look, that has fallen in love with that guy. And then that guy is best friends with her and her. And sort of him. And that is the... That guy right there, that is the uh, deceased dad. That is the deceased dad. That's the best shot I can get him. But he's dead. And that chick he's talking to is also dead. She, uh... The dad got, took a, uh... Winchester shotgun to the chest and then... Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then uh, that chick took a crossbow to me, and she bled to death. And then uh, her boyfriend in season two, he he takes a sniper round to the chest and he dies. And then uh, Fatty almost dies by a machete slash to the chest. Um, yes, this show is very graphic, by the way. Didn't know if you knew that. But, uh, all kinds of betrayal happens in between. There's all kinds of explosions, people die. Um. Yeah. No shit. 
So then they find out that the government's keeping pendants from them, and then the pendants activate electronics. So then they find out at the end of the season that the government has a secret base that they've been hiding from everyone. And uh, they turn on the power, but that just gives the government just enough time to nuke the nuke a whole entire city. So that takes Oklahoma out, of, and Oklahoma was like built up with all kinds of soldiers and shit. So now. I think his name was Charles the bad guy. He came in, swept in, but then in season two... Season two, people are coping from the uh, bomb blast, and the main, char main character and her crew are like, Oh shit, that's bad. I'm about to run out of record time. So basically, long story short, the government comes in, and uh, they try to control everybody. And then last part... Remember to leave a comment, like, and subscribe.